Welcome back all, this is Raid Shadow Legends and today we'll be in the Doom Tower level 110 hard. This is on the spider and we'll jump straight into it. We're using Drextra, Sill, Duchess, Mage and Reliquary Tender. Once the battle's completed and everything then we'll jump in and we'll show you how we've got all the masteries and, and things set up on these champions. It's a pretty well balanced team. Got HP burns here, you know, buffs and debuffs in our champions. Not the fastest team, but it's the team that always gets the job done. And you can see we've got plenty of buffs out there at the moment. And Plenty on ourselves as well, perfect bales and things. Increased attack, shields. You know, the team's not speed tuned at all, it's, you know, we use these champions in other areas of the game. Some burns happening. Got some stuns out there as well. The team is designed for the spider here. This is what it's really designed for. There are plenty of poisons on us, but we'll get them removed very shortly. The maze removes all the poisons. We get some shields up. That'll help with our defense. Dusters will keep healing a lot of the time, keeping them alive. There we go, continuous heal, removes all the bust from us. Increased defense. Yeah, but you've got to bring champions in which will remove those buffs and remove the poisons from us. Slow down the boss as well and his movements. You know, you can bring in champions as well, which, you know, could stun the spiderlings. You know, boost turn meter for yourself as well on your champions.
Sully but surely wearing the bus down. If you have time guys as well check out the website www.simraid.com sim is s-i-m-r-a-i-d.com it's something I've been working on you know I'm adding the videos from YouTube to there I'm working on each area of the game so every area in the end I will have a battle done for each stage each four each section of the game to show what champions I've used what their stats are so maybe it'll help people out, you know, to set up a team. If they've got those champions, they can set up and use those champions if they're stuck on a certain stage or floor in the game. And once I have that done, I'll make additional videos of the same, same stages and things using different champions. So if everybody wants, you know, has some champions and wants me to try out, or, you know, I'll try out some videos to see if I can making of their cha the champions they have in their teams. get a legendary shard usually when you beat this floor as a reward but you only get it the first time around each time but you know it's a great little bonus each month legendary shard from the spider 110 on hard okay and that was the team there we used so we're going to the champions and we'll show you how we got the team set up first off we have Drexter He's in two sets of perception and speed. He is fully booked out with his books. He yeah, the legendary books they're using there. His masteries, we have him in a defense and a support role. Now yeah, I won't go in to click each one of these. You can do that in your own account. You just click on the picture and it shows the information as you can see there. But if you're getting up to this stage in the game, you'd know about that anyway. Next we have Sylvie Drakes with her mastery. She's in a fence and a support role. Artifacts. She's in one set of accessory, one set of speed, one set of perception. You give her a lot of accuracy is what she wants in her account and speed, defense as well. She's fully booked out. All these champions are fully booked out when I'm using two sets of speed and a set of immortal that keeps the heal coming for Duchess to help keep her alive. The masteries, she is set up in a defense and a support role. Next we have the mage, he is in defense and support. I have him in Speed set and accuracy set. As you can see, I don't have all these pieces all done out, you know, maxed out or anything. So he could improve, do a lot better, you know, the more damage and things he's doing. But he works the way he is, so I've just left him in that. He's an epic champion. He's booked out as well. Then last of all, we have Relic Tender. Now, she's only a rare champion, so, you know, everybody in the game pretty will get her over time. She's booked out with her books. Artifacts, I have her in a divine speed, sets of speed and gives her an extra bit of healing as well. She's not fully booked out as you can see here. I mean, fully worked in some of her items here. She does have quite a bit of speed, you know, 209 speed, resist to 220. And her masteries, her masteries is in defense and a support role. But as you can see, I have the stats here in the side of the video anyway, showing what the champions all are, each item they're on, how their sets are, their speed, their attack, 
So yeah, guys, that was the, the Doom Tower hard. I just thought I'd show you that. And we'll end the video off there. It's on the Spider 110. Thank you, and we'll see you next time.